Hello beautiful Capricorn, thank you so much for being here today. My name's Marie Rose from Tarot Readings Live and we're here to do your forecast for the next 7 to 14 days. So let's see what we have for Capricorn please. What do we have for Capricorn please, thank you. What is it that we have for Capricorn? Thank you. Wow, resistance Capricorn. And that took so long to come out, I know it was at the back of the pack. But resistance, what are you resisting? What are you not wanting to change or make a move on? What are you hanging on tight to? What else have we got for Capricorn, please? Thanks. Resilience. Resistance and resilience. Is that bizarre? It's like you're hanging on to something even though it's causing you heaviness, despair, exhaustion. You're hanging on to it for dear life and you're afraid to let go. You're afraid to let something go that's weighing you down, that's causing a heaviness in your heart and in your body. What is it that you're not letting go of, Capricorn? Let's find out. Someone here knows that they're in, they're tired and they're exhausted of doing this, but you still hold on to it. You're holding on to a thought, a feeling, a situation, an action that you know is making you tired and is not good for you. Look at that. The Five of Pentacles. And yet you feel alone. With lack of motivation to do anything. You may be in financial ruin as well, but you keep hanging on to it. Or you keep doing the same thing. Even though this is weighing on you. And this is not judging you. This is telling you what's coming here. You feel like you're blocked in a situation, that you're, you can't move out of this situation. There's something here, Capricorn, that you know that it's, it's not good for you. You know that it's not good for you. But you can't see a way out of here. You can't see a way out. Or you're not willing to deal with the consequences of making, of leaving that situation, of leaving that person. Strength. You need to find your strength, they're saying, Capricorn. You need to gain strength. Now I understand. This is someone that is Look at that. The Queen of Wands. Capricorn, can I tell you something? The Queen of Wands is an energy that says enough is enough. It's a fire sign. You don't mess with the Queen of Wands because the Queen of Wands will burn you if she has to. And that's a figure of speech, not actually burn you. But what I mean by that is she'll put you in your place very, very quickly if you're out of line. And what they're saying is, Capricorn, this situation is weighing on you and yet you still keep hanging on to it. And I feel that someone here is hanging on to it because either you're financially dependent on, on someone or something or a situation here and you don't see a way out of this. Because if you leave, you feel that the consequences are going to be so hard to deal with that you stay where you are, despite it being heavy on you. And they're saying, Capricorn, please find your strength and grab that energy of the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is someone with this huge amount of power and push. 
being an earth sign you're very stable, you're very grounded, you're worried about making any major moves. You like to be grounded, you like to be certain, you like to be, you don't like to rock the boat or, or harm anyone. And that, we're not asking you to harm anyone, they're not saying harm, they're just saying find your strength. And it's not about hurting people here, like hurting them feeling in the feelings I'm saying not physically absolutely not but it's it's someone that's worried about hurting someone's feelings here and they're saying no what's this doing to you free yourself free yourself from this situation allow yourself to free yourself you may be dealing with an Aries a Leo or Sagittarius as well Capricorn Someone who's very stubborn, someone who's very fiery, someone who's very, you know, the dark side of, of the fire sign is, is huge. It's like a dragon with a fire. You may be dealing with someone who's narcissistic, who's manipulative, who's determined. But you need to find the strength to free yourself from this situation. Because it's got, it, you're exhausted already, my love. It's costing you mentally, physically, emotionally. Capricorn, please. The maiden. Free yourself. Free yourself to believe that there's beauty out there. That there's a different path for you here. Emotions, look at that, absolutely. It's, it's causing havoc in your emotions. But I feel that you're also emotionally attached to this person, to this place, to these people, to this group. That although you'd like to take a new path and be on your own, emotionally you're finding it hard to let go. The journey. This is a journey that only you can take. Whether you choose to stay or to go is going to be totally up to you, Capricorn. It's your journey. It's your decision. It's your willpower. It's your strength. Look at that. I love this card. The hero. Capricorn, you need to be your own hero here. You need to know when enough is enough and free yourself from what's holding you back, from what's not allowing yourself to be free, but is keeping you in this prison state of loneliness and despair. If you are your own hero, you will see that you can achieve anything you put your mind to. All is possible here. You may be dealing with a fire sign here. The fire sign is very strong here. The fire sign is very strong. Aries, Leo or Sagittarius here. You may be dealing with someone of these signs or you have this very strong in your sign. Last message for Capricorn, please. What do you want to say, Archangel Michael? What do you want to tell Capricorn today? Let's fix up these cards. Trust the guidance you're receiving. Archangel Uriel has blessed you with a brilliant epiphany. I am also present to clear away your worries so you can trust your divine guidance. Not only have you got Archangel Michael, but you've got Archangel Uriel. Ask for their guidance. Ask for their protection while you make the move and the decision that you need to to free yourself from being resilient. Ask them to help you fight the resistance and do what's right for you. 
for someone else here they're saying to me for someone else here it may be that you are going through a divorce and although this person is taking you with everything that they have in their strength in their determination in their power to succeed that don't give up don't give up and persist and use your resilience to win don't give up you'll be able to free yourself from this and become your hero self hero look at that you'll be so happy with yourself Capricorn that you gave it everything and you made your story change no one has power over you no one has the right to power to overpower you to manipulate you you will gain the strength that you need to get stronger and free yourself from this situation Capricorn, I hope that resonates with somebody. Lots of love and light your way. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.